Hey guys, it's Jen. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another weekly grocery haul and meal plan. This week I have a small high V haul for you as well as a $100 Aldi haul. All right, so I stopped at high V while Kira was at dance tonight and I just got a couple like, uh, I don't know, like themey things for Halloween school lunches. So I got these Hostess Scary Cakes by the way, this is all junk food because, you know, there's nothing really Halloween themed that's that healthy that you can buy in the store. Like you can make, you know, carrots and cheese sticks and all that stuff. Uh, I got these Hotel Transylvania fruit snacks. I thought those would be fun for Halloween lunches. I got these little, um, the, what are they called? Vampire teeth. You can like fold these up and put them in like a bagel and make it like put little eyes on them and make it look like a monster. Um, I got Halloween napkins. These were only like $1.25. What else? I got Peeps, which I thought these were priced high. These were like $1.48. I got uh, Frankenstein and Black Cats. Uh, they have the pumpkin ones there, but those are like you know common so I thought these would be harder to find and then I got these are not Halloween but I found these emoji pop tarts aren't they cute I thought that would be cute if I want to do an emoji themed lunch and then the only other thing that I got are these uh, Cadbury cream eggs but they're Cadbury scream eggs I don't know if you can see it I hate Cadbury eggs I mean I can take like one bite but other than that I think they're gross so yeah, that's just quickly uh, what I got from Hy-Vee to stash in my pantry for Halloween lunches. Okay, so here's a look at everything I got from Aldi. I decided to go there this week and actually I did not get it done during the weekend since we were out of town. So I'll just show you the produce that I got first. Um, I did get a Caesar salad kit because we are going to have lasagna this week and so I thought that would be quick to eat with that. I don't normally buy bagged salad, but like I said, I was in a time crunch since we were out of town. So I got a garden salad, uh, just bag of lettuce to have with taco salad this week. I got one package of baby carrots to eat with hummus. I also got some full-size tomatoes to slice up for sandwiches. And then I got a pineapple to cut up when we had our tacos this week. I thought that would be good. I also got some bananas, we were all out of those. And then I grabbed some of the Wild Wonders cherry tomatoes. I like to make caprese salad with these and have them in salads. I grabbed one package of blueberries and then one package of strawberries and I'll wash those up for the kids to have for breakfast. I got one English cucumber to cut up to dip in hummus and to put on salads. And then these were new at Aldi. They are the Delalo Roasting and Grilling Veggie Marinade. I thought they looked really interesting. And so I went ahead and grabbed the honey sesame and the garlic and herb. I assume these are temporary at Aldi, but when they have this kind of stuff, I always like to grab it just to try it out. And then they also still had some of these Arla medium cheddar cheeses and we've been eating these a lot for snacks and so they didn't have very many left so I went ahead and grabbed two of those along with some of the turkey uh, sausage snack sticks. I always get these and we use them for snacks. I got one block of cream cheese. I also got some of the mini guacamole cups. I like to eat those with my egg bites in the mornings. I grabbed one package of the cage-free brown eggs and then this was also a temporary item the stonyfield organic strawberry smoothies i grabbed those connor is having his tonsils out this week so i thought that would be great to have on hand for that they don't expire for a while um, i also grabbed some cheeses so i grabbed some of the shredded parmesan cheese just to have on hand in the refrigerator so this is the kind that is shredded a little bit larger than the green can and then I also grabbed some fresh mozzarella to make caprese salad with if I wanted to take that for lunch or have it as a side for dinner this week. I also grabbed some of the classic hummus. This is my favorite hummus from Aldi and then for the kids just for quick snacks I grabbed some of these cheese dip and cracker sticks. Kira likes to take those in her bag. 
I grabbed some sunflower kernels. These are great on salads. I love them um, to put on those and they were on sale. So I grabbed a package of those. I also got some spinach wraps for the kids to take to school for their turkey sandwiches and wraps to lunch. These were also on sale. Uh, these are like the Ritz mini cheese sandwich crackers. So I went ahead and grabbed a box of those. These are great to throw in the kids lunches or they can take them for snack as well. And then we're having a freezer meal of lasagna this week. So I got one package of garlic bread. One night we're just gonna do chips and sandwiches. So I just got a package of the sour cream and onion potato chips. Those are the kids favorite kind. Uh, we were out of some of our nuts that we normally like to keep on hand for snacking, so I grabbed a bag of cashews. And then these were new also. These are the Kind Protein Bars in the Crunchy Peanut Butter. I went ahead and grabbed these. Um, there were only four in the box, but they had, it looks like only 12 grams of carbs per bar, so I thought that would be a good option for me or Adam to take to work during the week for breakfast if we needed something quick. I grabbed some M&Ms. I like to keep those on hand for just small treats for the kids. And then I needed some ground cinnamon and some cumin for the pantry. These are super cheap at Aldi. They're only like $1.19, so I like to get them there. I also grabbed some fruit and grain cereal bars in the strawberry. Those are Connor's favorite. He likes to eat those for breakfast, and they are comparable to the Nutri-Grain bars. I also got one 12 pack of Diet Coke, some uh, unsweetened iced tea for Adam to take to work. He likes to have that in his refrigerator at work to have during the work week. And then I also grabbed a box of Capri Sun. Uh, the kids don't drink this a ton at home, but they do take it for their lunches. And then I really hit the jackpot on discounted fish and chicken. So they had, you can see this Atlantic salmon is $4 off of $7.91. So that made it $3.91. Uh, the date on these was the next day, but I just went ahead and froze them in the deep freeze that night. So that's a super good deal. I've never seen meat marked down that much at Aldi before. They also had chicken marked down. So like you can see, this one was originally $5.70 and they had it for $3 off. So that one ended up being $2.70. This one was $6 off, so I ended up getting this huge package of chicken for $1.68, which was really awesome. And then this one was $5 off, so I got it for $1.23. So uh, that was like my find of <laughs> the day for sure. So I went ahead and put that in the freezer. So that's what I got this week. Let me show you the meal plan. So on Sunday, we were actually in Kansas City, so I obviously didn't have any meals planned for that day. Um, on Monday, we drove home, and then I just went, ran to Hy-Vee and grabbed some chicken and noodles for us to have for dinner. On Tuesday, we are going to have um, chicken tacos and taco salad. Wednesday, we're going to have wraps and sandwiches and fruit and chips. Thursday, we are going to have our freezer lasagna meal that I prepped a couple weekends ago. And then along with that, I'll make a Caesar salad and some garlic bread. Friday night, we always go out or have pizza, and Connor is having surgery that day, so we'll have to play that by ear. And then Saturday, I don't plan out that far. So that is it for my super quick grocery haul this week. Uh, next week, we'll be back to business as usual. Thanks again for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.